So you might be in a position where for some reason your Android phone is for some reason not updating its applications. Now, this can happen for a few different reasons. The very, very first thing I recommend doing is just double checking one specific thing, your internet and Wi-Fi connection. This can by far be the easiest way to go and fix this particular problem or these particular issues that you're having. So what you're going to want to do is you want to go and make your way over to your settings application. So just within your settings app right here. And all you're going to want to do is go into network and internet and go ahead and update your network and internet settings. That way they're actually fully you know, compatible with their you know, Wi-Fi connection around you or a cell connection that's around you, something like that. Because if you're not updating your specific internet connection properly, that can probably be one of the biggest problems you're having. So update your internet connection, that can be the one thing you do. Now on top of that, you might actually be updating an application that may not have an update available or the update was faulty and pulled and the Google services, basically the Google Play Store, hasn't updated that specific server yet. So what you're going to have to do there is pretty much just wait it out. All you're going to have to do is just wait until Google fixes that or they you know, re-release that update or whatever the case is. There can be lots and lots of problems and issues that arise from that. So just go through, see if you can just kind of wait it out and you know, kind of update the you know, specific application separately. That's another thing you can do as well. If that's still not working, another thing you may want to try doing is going through and literally just updating your phone. So make your way over to your system settings of your so make your way over to your system settings of your particular phone, hop into system, scroll down into system update, and see if there is a system update available. If there is, go ahead and update your Android phone, and that right there can probably end up fixing the problem as well. Finally, if none of these things are working, you can actually go through, restart your phone. You can also see if any of the Google Play services are down too. Those types of things can end up fixing the problem for you, and those are pretty much the main ways to fix it for you. If you have any other thoughts or questions, let me know in the comment section below. Hit the like button, that would mean so much, but definitely hit that subscribe button. More importantly than everything else, I love every single one of you guys. Hopefully I'll catch you guys in the next video.